hi guys welcome back to mama svj vlog how are you guys doing if you are new here you are welcome and if you are the only subscriber god bless you as you always come back to watch my video my people wonder shall never end do not be smart you know now before news now they land for our table on our mostly as the news they land for my table that's why they carry and come here to come share with on all right my people for today video go to wash and together with on all right my people more go watch the video to see what really they apple for inside the video my people Yes, your mom. Baby, <laughs> How are you? Yes. Are you on Instagram? Yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, wow. That's, that's fantastic. Thank you, sir. Yeah. No, you have done well for Nigeria. Thank you, sir. You Something has to and I had you had a sojourn with uh, Abiola. Yeah. Abiola was in our house. I know, I remember. <laughs> <laughs> well, there is nowhere I go people don't mention his name. Yeah, 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 the, the, the very generous person. Oh. Very good hearted person. Oh. Yeah. He was my adopted father. I worked for him for only two years and he just fell in love with me. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, in 1992, my wife was added over to Abiola by his father in Egypt. We drove all the way from Lagos to Egypt. Just to be here yes, 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 yes. Ah, may his soul continue to rest in peace. Thank you very much for this. Yes, yeah, right. I appreciate this. Oh, my pleasure. I, I wanted us to meet like this first, and uh, if you don't mind, we continue to oh, right. interact. Yes. I will give you my ideas. Okay. What I think will be the way forward, but you are the expert. So that's why I'm here. Uh, I want to tell you that I need to seek your help. So that we can be better focused. I don't want to come like leaders who are just interested in winning elections. No. From day one, we must know what we want to do. Yes. We must know what we want to do. And we're very serious. Some people think, oh, baby, he's joking. I feel insulted every day. My people say, oh, baby, he's looking for a that. Over 60. I should that's, be retiring. That's, that's, this, is what, this actually is the same thing. This is our nation. We are not living to the politicians. No. We have to build ourselves. We want our leaders. I'm so happy to see you. We have to rush back to the airport. Oh, Otherwise, how about you my tea? Honestly speaking, with a very serious daily conflict, I just have to this in one month, two months. But I spoke with the, the big, um, the big king things. So, it's just like imagine if you were Kano in the southeast, if you get to sit down with him and if you see him as what. Maybe he can pacify those people. Okay. Like them. Big ones. I have gathered them and they are ready. That's 
want the need, but they want, they want it to be comprehensive, not just the heart. No, he said they cannot control the bodies. If, say, for instance, Major State is having peace with them, and Kaduna is not, the foot soldiers will go to the change command and go to the energy. So they are fighting a war to, to, to their eyes. They are fighting for you. You know, like what Putin is doing. It's illegal. But if you look at him from his own side, he still is the survival of Russia. It's protecting his enemy. The same thing that you cannot tolerate a satellite enemy goes to your country. So how can I tolerate If you understand. But what he did is illegal because still you, you cannot occupy somebody with war. So what they are doing is illegal, but what is in, we are trying to survive, exist. What uh, Putin needs is assurance, genuine one. And what is real trend needs assurance. Honestly speaking, you can gather them all of them. And you know, the people are in the area. No, no matter how somebody is, among the all of us, there's somebody who he talks to somebody, he must listen, he must listen eh? just like this. Just like this. If you dial the right people and talk to this people, they will stop, they will put down the foot. But the government is. I don't think what is the government is intentionally uh, doing this uh, as a president. Presidency is those that they don't want. Uh, if you look at them, why are they? Um, they don't want somebody who is not in their side to, to come up with any solution or have any credit of anything. But they can't be doing competition with people's lives. If I say national interest, because all this area farming was abused. So you see, when you people join politics, we are very happy. Together we can rescue this country from incompetence because it's just all about incompetence. Look, a few years back, I'm sure you know, you know about Egypt and Cairo very well. They had huge problems. Nobody went today, everybody now is going to Cairo. Yes. It's all about leadership. All it takes is one man, not a multitude, not a crowd, just one man. One, one team might. Now, for scarcity in Kaduna, on the way now everywhere, we have everything. God gave us everything. We've not been able to fix our refineries. We've not been able to decide on what we want to do with subsidy. We've not been able to say if we are repairing our refineries, uh, are you selling it? What are you doing? Nothing. Now, so I just wanted to see if what the insecurity and this unity, I believe, is number one. There is no country that can make progress when everybody is working just at cross purposes. We have, we have to streamline our direction. We have to coordination. Cooperation. And Nigeria is picking up everybody's hand. Everybody. Hmm. And the resources are there. Yes, you have been to Oh, many times. Abu, we used to go to Abandu Belo University by road, no, nothing, no problem. Yes. I was saying this is the this used to be the bubbliest city in the yes. north. Yes. 
That's why everybody, almost every general I knew, uh, lived in the, Kaduna. There is certainly in Kaduna. Uh, yes, everybody came to Kaduna. Very peaceful. That's what I was talking And you know, Abuja actually to the north is like, uh, well, Kaduna to the north is actually like Abuja to the nation. It was created by the colonial powers called Spash. So, it was like a planned city. There is one question I've always wanted to ask you, sir. How did you gain the confidence of the people you want to meet? <laughs> <laughs> you see, uh, I came to the conclusion that politicians must solve our problems. We have to solve it ourselves. Honestly speaking, I haven't been in the right. I have not really listened to all the problems. So I'm not the first person to go, and I'm sure I'm not the last person. I'm trying to be many people have gone. What they want is somebody is lost that is not coming to the city, and they will come. So when we call them, they, they come from many, many far places, you know. Sometimes two or three days journey, because they, they just tell us, give us four, five days. Together, all of them. These are the activities of the Saudi Arabia. We want to stop. So my greatest shock in life is that the government who you are doing this sacrificing your life to do this does not look at it that way. They 
better you know okay this man is not with us so my people now the video now on a new watch me so on a see what it happened for inside the video all right my people are going to like to end the video for you make gonna let me know what you on a team for the comment section and if you never subscribe make gonna subscribe so that i don't go miss any latest just way at the upload and i'm about to like come on away next time bye guys guys in my next video bye guys